second thing I want to talk to you about today is uh, this comes up a bit with me, and, I, and I, I'm a big believer in this um, that nobody can make you feel anything. Nobody can make you happy. Nobody can make you sad. Nobody can make you feel bad about yourself. Nobody can make you feel good about yourself and satisfied and content. Now, there's a little caveat here. As long as, this is as long as there is no violence, be it physical or, or, or threat of or, or whatever. But to, to just say that, you know, Sharon makes me feel bad about myself when she says this. Well, that's not on Sharon. That's on me. That's on us. I, I, I think we have the, the ability to control a lot of those things. Um, and it's all about how much space we give them in the first place. But also, I think you can still be aware that you are feeling something. But instead of blaming Sharon or projecting that on someone else, I, I try and think, okay, why am I feeling that? Well, first of all, I think, okay, fucking feel that. Like, just feel it. All right? First of all, just feel it. And, and then look into why. I'm feeling it, why that's an issue for me, why, whatever, okay? Because I think there's a lot of, um, you know, being able to just say, look, that person did that to me and therefore this is what I am now. Um, that happened to me and therefore that's what I'm going to do now to other people and that's not really, that's not good enough for me. I don't want to, I don't want to do that, right? So, you know, I think the more we can concentrate on the fact that nobody can make us feel anything but us, if there is no violence or threat of violence, that is, then the more we can take control and build and grow and change and heal ourselves. And that is super important to me, and, and I, hope, um, I hope that might be a little bit helpful for you too.